routine video and I'm super excited for this video because I actually got to go to a really cool place to film it. A huge thank you to Johnson Wales University for sponsoring this video. They actually sent me to North Carolina to film this video and it was super exciting because I actually have never been to the East Coast. I live in California so I flew all the way across the country. So basically I got to experience being a student at Johnson Wales University for a day and it was so much fun. I absolutely loved it. The campus is beautiful and I got to meet so many awesome people. If you guys didn't know, I'm actually in college so it was really cool to see how different colleges are and get to like attend their classes and just see all the cool awesome stuff that they had on campus. So without further ado, Further ado, let's hop right in to my school routine slash day in my life for Johnson Wales University. Johnson Wales University was only 5.4 miles away from where I was staying, but it was actually only an 11 minute drive, which is really quick compared to where I live in LA, and it was such a pretty drive. I really enjoyed seeing all the beautiful trees because it's fall there right now, so it was so pretty. The first class that I went to today was a business class and I'm actually majoring in business if you guys didn't know that already. But they have some really awesome majors to choose from. They have a huge variety of business, marketing, management, and food service majors. All the way from hotel management to entertainment management. I just think it's so awesome that they have so many different majors to choose from. Also comment down below and let me know what your favorite subject in school is. Mine was definitely art when I was in school. So yeah, I'd like to know that so comment that down below. was a fashion and merchandising class which I think is really awesome because not all schools always offer fashion and I'm super into fashion so I thought that was pretty awesome and I absolutely love the classroom it was super bright and colorful which I always think brightens your mood and just gets you inside the creative spirit so it was really fun we got to watch runway shows in the class and it was a really fun class to attend was over I had some free time to explore the campus and I actually bumped into some friends. So this is Sam and Alexis and they actually gave me a tour of the campus so Sam is super awesome. He is a fashion and marketing major and he's actually been dancing and acting for seven years and fun fact about Sam is that he loves poetry so he's a really nice and fun guy and I think he's pretty cool. This is Alexis she is a baking and pastry major she loves to play tennis and fun fact about her is that she wants to move to Italy. She also has a great sense of humor and she is really funny she seriously made me laugh the entire day. This is the quad. This is basically the main part of the campus and also my favorite part of the campus. The quad is an awesome area for students to get together to do homework, study, relax, hang out with friends. It's just a really awesome area to go that's in the middle of campus to just de-stress. And it also has these awesome colorful chairs which I'm obsessed with. I think they're so cute and fun fact, they were actually really comfortable. So me, Sam, and Alexis just chilled out here in between our classes and it was a lot of fun. I love how relaxing the quad is. It's just super nice to just chill out with friends and it's also so so, so so pretty it's fall right now so all the leaves on the trees were turning yellow and falling and it was just so gorgeous i absolutely loved it And then we actually went to the library to get some studying done because we had some extra time in between our classes the library is right across the street from the quad, so we just walked over, and guys, you would not believe the amount of cookbooks that were inside of this library. It seriously, it was mind-blowing to me because I love cooking, so it was super cool to be able to see all these awesome cookbooks. And I totally recommend having study groups with your friends. It's just a lot more fun that way, and you'll get it done quicker than you would at home, and that way you can motivate each other and quiz each other, and it's just so much better. The library also had these beautiful sugar sculptures displayed that some of the students actually made for their finals and it was so crazy they actually had to walk them across the street from the classrooms that was like part of the final which I think is super crazy but they're so gorgeous and I can't believe these are like sugar like you can eat these guys so cool right? <laughs> Speaking of eating, all of that setting got us really hungry, so we headed over to the cafeteria to grab some lunch. And I know what you're thinking, cafeterias always aren't the best option, but guys, this cafeteria was so good. It was a buffet style, and all the food was seriously so amazing. I literally got so much food, and I ate my entire meal, so it was awesome. And me and Sam just chatted while we ate our lunch, and not gonna lie, this was probably my favorite part of the day, because food. I love food. It always makes everything better. <laughs> On my way to my next class, I passed through the quad, which is another nice area for students to just get together outside of school and hang out and even have some barbecues. I also ran into a couple more of my friends. This is Jay. She's majoring in baking and pastry, and this is actually her second degree. 
This is Gabby, her major is baking and pastry, and she loves mustaches. <laughs> and last but not least, this is Angie Leek. She's also baking and pastry, and she loves to be outside, go kayaking, and cliff jumping. Everyone at JWU was so nice and open and welcoming, and I just felt right at home the entire day. Halfway through the day, I'm in dire need of a coffee break, so of course I gotta stop and get coffee at my favorite place ever, Starbucks. Then I just went back to the quad to do some more studying and to get some editing done. I love going outside to get some work done just because I feel like it really motivates me to get stuff done and that way I'm not crammed in home because I just feel so much better when I'm outside. So of course I was just sipping on my coffee while I was doing some editing and some homework and of course I got a little distracted on Snapchat. If you guys have me on Snapchat then you would have seen this Snapchat that I took while I was there but if you aren't already make sure to add me you can scan the screen. The walk to each class is so nice and enjoyable just because I love this campus. It's so gorgeous and I love just the atmosphere and all of the apartments around it. I also love that you have a perfect view of downtown Charlotte. I think it's so cool that you go from city to the school and it's just so pretty here. I absolutely love it. I know you think of me too. Can we do it again? Can we crash and fall but get back on again? Alright, so we made it to the last class of the day, which is a baking and pastry class. If you guys didn't know, I absolutely love cooking and baking. I have ever since I was a kid, and I actually attend a class at my school. So I absolutely love the fact that they have such a wide variety of cooking, baking, and pastry majors. I think it's awesome, especially because this is my favorite subject. They also have a kitchen dedicated to Chef Emeril Lagasse, who is actually on Food Network. He's like super famous now, and I actually really look up to him. And he actually graduated from Johnson Wales University, which I think is super cool. And I just wanted to give you guys an outfit idea of an outfit that I would typically wear to school. So I'm just wearing this flannel. It's really nice and comfy because sometimes classrooms can get really cold and I like to be warm. Then I just threw on this graphic t-shirt with some french fries because I french fries are bae. And then I also am wearing some high-waisted jeans and this is just a really comfortable outfit that I love to wear to school. And at the end of the day, there was a coffee house event which was so much fun and Sam and Alexis actually threw this inside of the gym and we went and saw this really awesome Native American dancer. His name was Larry Yazzie and if you guys didn't know, I'm actually Native American so it was so cool to see. He came and told stories and danced for us and we had a little powwow. I kind of felt silly getting up and dancing but it was actually really fun and I had a really great time and I just loved learning about the culture and him spreading awareness. It was just a great night overall. aka Johnson Wales University. <laughs> I know a lot of you guys will be graduating high school next year, so definitely check out Johnson Wales University. It's an awesome school and I absolutely loved it. It was so pretty there and I just loved all the people and the experience. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to give it a big thumbs up if you liked it. And if you're new to my channel, then I would absolutely love it if you click that subscribe button down below to join our awesome, amazing Crafty Dog Crew family. We're super cool and awesome. So yeah, you should click that subscribe button to join. All right, so I'm gonna go now. I love you guys very, very much. A big enough hug and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Back to what I was saying. <laughs> <laughs>